Hello and welcome to the new Power Query tutorial video and in this video I want to show you how you can identify whether a number is odd, even, right or not. So that is that information is sometimes very helpful if you are performing some sort of operation which require this information either you are let's say dividing with odd or even, adding the odd or even, subtracting odd or even, right? Those type of things. So that is something you can I will show you how you can easily identify a particular number is odd or even and then you know perform the calculation for the calculation. So uh, before I show that just a quick information about this uh, this sheet uh, the Google sheet which for which the link is present in the description this link is present in the description and what it has is my since I have 280 plus videos related to power BI power query uh, all of these videos are present here in this sheet. Uh, with that, you can easily search the column, with easy, easily search the video by searching it from a title and uh, using the link which is present in column B, you can jump on that video. Also, you can see I'm maintaining the difficulty level to get the, um, to, to basically help you in your journey of whether beginner level, intermediate or advanced level. So, uh, this is the information that right now, as you can see, these many people are utilizing. Similarly, you can utilize it and also you can bookmark it so you can use it whenever you need. Also, there's information about the data set that I'm using. The data set link is present in description. Within data set folder, I have the Power BI folder where I use this Power BI Superstore data set in most of my example. So with that information, let me come back to the Power um, Query. And in this, uh, what do I have is this quantity column. In the quantity column, what do I have is the information uh, function and by the way this is present in transform menu right so within transformation you have information and you can basically say whether is even so what it does it checks it and give you the true and false based on whether it is even right similarly what you have is basically information about is odd whether the value is odd or even right so that is something which is available now another thing which you have is available sign which gives indication whether it is a positive value, negative value or a zero. It basically extracts the sign from the number and give you the desired output. In this case it will give you the one or positive. If it is negative then it will give you minus one and if it is zero then it will give you the zero. Right. So that is also something you can get it whether it is a positive value, negative value, zero value, what value it is and you can get the desired output. So I wanted to show you that this information functions are easily available which you can utilize and uh, get the desired output as per the needs of the business case you are handling. With that information, thank you so much and I'll meet you in the next video with a new topic.